Thing is, I don't even know if Lunacy Mage is actually the strongest. That Watch Post Rogue or maybe Libram Paladin are probably the actual strongest, but Lunacy Mage is really fun, right? Because you get to play Deck of Lunacy and then win, and Lunacy has an incredibly high win rate. <laughs> well, we're probably going to get a chance to run that back, because out of all of the games we've played so far, probably half of them have been against Lunacy Mage. <laughs> there it is. We get the run back. On instinct. Hell yeah, hey DJ, bring that deck back. <laughs> when I move, you move. Just like that. Hell yeah. Alright, Carrion Studies. <sighs> Once again, the question Far Watch Post or Felma? Maybe I'll try Felma first this time. Uh, Talon Ford Ring is interesting. Do I want Talon Ford Ring in this deck? Thing is, Dragon Maw Skystalker. I'm gonna. Okay. I can't think about what their discount cost is, their actual cost, because I'm going to pay four mana for Teacher's Pet, so I'll take the five. <laughs> when I move, you move, because that's how turn-based games work. That's how it. That's how we've always done it. Chess, checkers, Chinese checkers, go. Uh, hearts, the... That's, that's how, that's how, uh, go fish. Unless, of course, you get what you were hoping for, then you get to take another turn. Minesweeper. <laughs> oh, here we go. You built this for me? So we have Teacher's Pet on four. Tail and Fordring on five, Teacher's Pet on six. Ruined Orb. More like Ruined Orb, am I right? That is so much to kill this watch post. <laughs> that is like so much to kill one watch post. Hit him in his face. Thank you. Come on and slam, and welcome to No Grand. Uh, maybe that should have been over here. I don't want to get combusted. First person healer would like to have a conversation with a world champion Minesweeper player one day. Do, that would be... I mean, I guess a combination of hand speed, hand-eye coordination, and math. I wonder who the best Minesweeper player is, and if there's like an all-time leaderboard or something. I think I can just tail in, and I want to put it over here. And then next turn, next turn is looking pretty weak with just a teacher's pet. Both in the Grand Slams in hand is also kind of unfortunate. But when this Talon Fordring dies, we draw Primordial Protector, and it'll cost seven. Coin two. Oh, also using the Bigglesworth coin. Touche. Oh, Conjure Mana Biscuit. Oh, we just drew one. Okay. Let me load another teacher's pet in the old chamber there. All these things having death rattles is really annoying for this mage, right? This has a divine shield and a death rattle. There's the deck of lunacy. Okay. Clock's ticking. We gotta kill him before he gets to do lunacy stuff. Jesus H. Tap dancing Christ. That's uh, zero mana draw four for those paying attention. Oh yeah, luck does have something to do with Minesweeper for the first couple of- yeah, first couple of clicks. Gotta get lucky. Even if you're up all night till the sun, if you're up all night for good fun, first couple turns of Minesweeper, you gotta get lucky. Oh, malevolent strike. Very malevolent strike. <laughs> get Mookla, welcome to Monkey Town. Big Mookla, look at the size of this fist. Mookla. And I don't even have to pay the give your opponent two bananas tax. We're up all night to get monkey. <laughs> oh, no, I just want a Primordial Protector, I think. Where does this go? And this is going to draw Guardian Animals, which is actually kind of even better, somewhat. Eight health is pretty good. Run 
rotten to the core. Because we get to now guardian animals on eight. If she finds a way to flame strike us out of this game, which is, you know, it's possible. Flame strike is pretty bad. But also she did play lunacy. So it'd have to be a flame strike that she either generated off deck of lunacy or has been sitting on. She has drawn so many. Oh, this is actually, this is Kel'Thuzad. Kel'Thuzad has drawn so many cards. Milled, milled himself so many cards. Has watching this stream in the mornings been the secret to energizing first person healer that she's been lacking? Is it a fluke? Is it the shoes? Oh, gross. Not as bad as it looks, though. I mean, bad. But not as bad as it maybe looks. <laughs> I'm bloated python. Oh, you okay there, bloated python? You're looking a little overstuffed there. Like a really good beanbag chair. Because so I can primordial protect her on 8. Kazakus on 9 for a 10 mana golem? Oh, you... Oh my gosh, it's still his turn. So what is that? I am not stopping. Actually, what I'll probably do is Kazakus for a five mana golem. Is it a counter spell? In which case. Oh, no, it's a Netherwind portal. Dunk! I don't know, man. You're looking like you're in kind of rough shape there, bucko. You look like you're on thin... I oh, five mana, heal eight, get a 12-12. But it can't attack, and you're still dead. We're showing 21 damage. You have to get above 21 life, or you have to do some taunting, or you have to get ran the fudge over. Ran over. <laughs> I caught drinking, hardly ever caught sober. <laughs> you about to get ran the comp static over. We built board tempo while removing theirs simultaneously. Hearthstone. 